Hey guys, what's up? This is How To's in Minecraft again, and I am going to be showing you guys how to find diamonds. So, let's see. I'm playing with Dude with a Diamond today, and we are going to start getting some wood. We would have gotten all of this before, but we want to show you guys this is legit. And this is where we spawned, right here in actually would have been right here, but Actually, I dug I this spawned, out. I spawned in a big tree. Yeah, you probably did spawn a tree. But we are going to find diamonds. So, hey dude, can you get some wood? Yeah. We're going to need wood. Guys, that's the first thing you want to get is wood. Because you can't get anything without wood. So we're going to get some wood. So, I called this tree... I already called this tree. Alright, so guys, we're probably gonna wanna get about sixteen pieces, I think. And then I guarantee we will find diamonds. I mean this method that I'm using is un unbeatable. So Dude, you get about 16 pieces of wood, and I'll get about 16 pieces of wood. Alright, how many do you have so far? Uh, three. You have three pieces of wood? Oh, well, you've been stealing my stuff. Oh, sure, blame it on me. Hey, I climbed the tree, and then you climbed it. No, I was here first, bro. Actually, you might have been here first, but... Alright, so I'm done with this tree right now. Well, I claim this tree. Alright, so I'm pretty sure right here is where we spawned. So let's just do this. And right in that block is where we spawn, guys. So, oh, here's a desert over here. This is kind of cool, but we're not here for the desert. And you know what, guys? I'm going to be in peaceful for this tutorial. Just because this isn't a tutorial where mobs are included. No mobs. You can be here, cows. You are fine. But... So you mean I can have a mini-map? No, you can have your mini-map. He is playing with Zan's mini-map. And I am playing with no mobs. Very so, good. dude, do you have about all the wood you need? How yeah. many more pieces of wood do you need? Uh... Five. Uh, okay, I'll get three and you get two, okay? Because apparently you're very slow at getting wood. Two and... Three. Alright, do you have two pieces? Here, wait. How many? Owen, you're good, you're good. You don't need any more wood. Okay, you can so take that with you. No, 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 Owen, I already got you three extras. Come on, dude. Extra wood doesn't hurt, though. But what we want to do is we want to take this wood and turn it all into wood planks. And then take these wood planks and we'll make a crafting table. And then here, here's some wood for you. So... We're going to place our crafting table right outside of where our mine is going to be. So we're going to take this, and we're going to make some tools. So guys, always, always, always start off with a wood pick in your new world. Always make a wood pick. Because you can't get any resources without a wood pick. And then here's how we're going to mine down, okay? We're going to mine in this stair shape. And as soon as I get some cobblestone... Actually, guys, you know what? We may need some coal here pretty quick. Because this is not going to be very bright in here without coal. And is it really turning nighttime? Oh, you're kidding me. Okay. Actually, not. Oh, you're not? Oh, I thought you were. So, I'm just going to go this way and hope I find some coal. Because I do not want you guys just to be sitting in the dark as I blab on about how to find diamonds. Because that would not be a very fun tutorial for you. So, let's see if I can't find some coal quick. I am probably lost, but let's see if I can find some. Wow, guys, this world is void of coal. 
This is just sad. Um, let's see. That way is my way home. Let's see if there's anything over here. Mm, no, there is no coal. It would be kind of nice if we were in extreme hills so we could find some coal, but we are not. So, oh, you know what? There might be some coal over here. Are we going to get lucky and find some coal? Any coal? Anywhere? Anybody? Any coal? I would take any coal from anywhere. Um, there is no coal anywhere. <laughs> so, oh, was that coal? No, of course that wasn't coal. What am I thinking? There's no coal in this world. So, let me just check up here really quick, because this thing is actually quite cool. I kind of like this. Oh, hey, dude with the diamond, I saw your name. I thought. Didn't I? Maybe I didn't. Alright, so, let's see. My home is back this way, I believe. Oh, is this a ravine? This is a very tiny ravine. I did see your name. I knew it. I knew it, I knew it, I knew it. Are you back by the base? Well, so am I. But what are you doing with a wood sword, huh? Uh, dude, I'm making all my materials. I have a sword, a pick, and a shovel. So, uh, I need an axe. So, guys, here's what we're gonna do, okay? We cannot find any coal in this world. So what we're gonna do... Whoa, what did I pick up? I picked up gravel. But what we're gonna do, guys, is Ooh, we are going gravel. to make some charcoal. And to do this, we need our furnace. And we'll put it right there. And we need a log. We might need multiple logs. We need logs, but we don't want them turned into wood planks. And I will show you what we use these for in a second. So guys, I'm just pretending like you guys don't know anything about Minecraft, okay? And that's actually probably good for those of you that don't know much about Minecraft watching this tutorial. So, you take your wood, any kind of wood, and as long as it's not wood planks, you can put it in this top part of your furnace, and then you can put wood in the bottom. And that will give you charcoal right here. No, 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 my charcoal. See, this is charcoal. And now we need some sticks so we can make torches. Because we do want torches. Of the sticks, I have a bunch of sticks. I have enough sticks. So guys, isn't that much better for you? I mean, honestly. Oh yeah? Well, I have 64 and 55. Why did you turn all those into sticks? Uh... Did you turn all of your wood into sticks? Mm... You did? Oh man, that's that's nice. So, and that's, that's really nice. So, what we are going to do now is I am going to show you how we make our way down. So as you can see guys, I'm just digging this staircase down. And now if you punch the F3 button on your keyboard, no, don't actually punch it, you will see this. This little thing with a bunch of data and squigglies and stuff I don't understand pops up. And the only thing I pay attention to, unless I need coordinates, is this Y factor right here. And this shows us what level we're on. So as you can see, when I go up a level, it goes to 54, and now it goes to 55. So, you know what, I'm going to put this on full screen for you guys so you can see this a little better. There we go. So, we need to be on level 16 for this tutorial, because that is where the diamonds are. But, if we want to get down there faster, we're going to need iron. So guys, this is 
the best way I have found to get down because you don't have to mess with making ladders. You don't have to worry about what block you're standing on when you dig down. Like, you won't fall into caves or anything. And nothing really can go wrong with this, except when you find iron, and that doesn't really go wrong with it. So, this is time. good. It's nighttime, it doesn't matter, I've turned my world into peaceful for this great Minecraft tutorial. So, so guys, now what we're going to do is take this iron back up and smelt it. Are you still making tools, dude? Um, you are, aren't you? Alright, so, guys, this is actually great, because eight pieces of iron and will... One piece of charcoal will smelt eight pieces of iron exactly. So, what we are going to do is take this iron and make an iron pickaxe, because you need an iron pickaxe or a diamond pickaxe to mine out diamonds. A stone pickaxe like what we are using here does not work. And it, nice. it takes three iron ingots, which is what we have now, to make an iron pickaxe. So now that we have this, we will go down into our mine. And once we get down to the bottom, I'm going to have Dude, who is helping me, find some iron, or some diamonds with me. So this pickaxe is a lot faster. This will make the tutorial go a lot faster. So, let's see. So as you can see, now I'm on level 39, and now I'm on 38, and 37, and on down. So I'm going to take this out, because this is kind of getting annoying now. So yeah, guys, you cannot find diamonds on any level higher than 16, I believe. I believe they only spawn on level 16 and below. And I'm going to pick up this iron because we still kind of need iron. Actually, it is uh, 13. No, it's 7. Or it's 16. Oh. Unless they spawn on 16 and grow up, I think they can be on level 17 and 18. But other than that, they will not be on 17 and 18. I have um, all the tools that I need. I have a stone sword, I have a stone ticket, I have a stone shovel, and I have a stone axe. That is very helpful. Thank you for that. So, dude, let's see what level we're on. We are on level 23, 22. So we are almost down to diamonds, guys. This is good. And I'll show you what we do. Oh, are you kidding me? We found a cave. Okay, so... At least that could be diamonds. Yeah, but this is not what I want for this tutorial. Let's see. Huh. This is quite interesting. Wait, Isaac. Hmm? I have an idea. Oh, cool. Goody. No, Isaac, I'm going to throw down some stuff, and then you can make a staircase down, and then we'll still go down. Oh, and I can get back out. I'm just kind of scoping out the area quick. Okay, I'm going down. Okay. There are no Ow. mobs here. Wow, we have found diamonds. We have? We have. Watch as I fall in the lava and die. No, I'm kidding. But, yeah, guys, that yep. is diamond. Diamond. Totally. That was very fast, actually. So there are caves like this, as you can see, on lava level. And these will lead you to big lava pits like this every now and then. And every now and then in those big lava pits, there will be diamonds like what you see here. So that was actually oh, I'm the gold. very fast. You can have that gold, though, and I do not want it. I want this diamond. Oh, this is a big patch of diamond, guys. Whoopee. So, guys, just a quick tip. Do not mine underneath you. See, if I would have mined that block out, 
it would have fallen right in the diamond, or right in the lava. What you do is you put a block underneath this, and then you put this block here, and you walk over here, and you mine out that block. And then, is there a block under this? There is a block under this. So now we can mine this out, and then we can mine this out. And there's a block under that. There is a block under that. So now we can mine this out. And is there any more diamonds anywhere? There appears not to be. But guys, we are not here to find diamonds in caves. As fun as that is. We are here to find diamonds in branch mining. So, I'm going to come back up to where our way out is. Dude, can you meet me here? Um, where we came in at? Wait, where? Uh, just a sec. Are you lost? No, I'm still grabbing the gold. Okay. So, then what we're going to do, guys, we are just going to pretend we never found this cave. We did, but pretend we didn't. We are on level 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13. So we'll just mine on level 13. I think level 13 is the best level to mine on. This is level, yeah, this is level 13. So, the reason you mine on 13 is because we are standing on 13 here, and then you see level 14 here, level 15 here, and level 16 above your head when you are mining. So, now what you do when you get down to level 13, or, I mean, you can go below 13 if you want to as well, but you mine out a block to this side, and a block to this side, but I'm not going to mine that way because I know there is a ginormous lava pit that way. So actually, let's mine this out quick. Okay, that's all I'm going to do. Hey, dude, I see your name. You're you're mining out gold, aren't you? Oh, and don't don't mine that with a stone pick. Why? Because it can't break gold. It'll just break the block. You need an iron pick. I don't have any of that gold. Uh, you've been mining it with a stone pick this whole time. Alright, so guys, I'm sorry, my brother is still kind of new to this. But anyway, what we do now is you mine out right here. I thought that you could only do that with diamonds! No, 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 you do it with gold too. It doesn't work with gold either. But you go like this, guys. So, I just threw my torch like a doofus. Uh, dude, I found some coal. Should I get it? Uh, sure, why not? But... So now we are going to mine, since we already mined this out, we can see this block and this block. So when we go in here, we see this block and this block. So if we mine here, we'll be seeing these same blocks. But if we mine here, we've already seen this block. So then we'll see this block and the block right next to it. And therefore, we get more efficiency out of the deal. So now, when we mine down here, we're seeing this block, and if we mine here, we'll see this block. So are you getting the idea, guys? You want to skip two in between each of your branches in your branch mine. And then we're just going to keep mining this way a little ways and see what we find. Do we find anything? We find anything? So guys, another thing you can do, and I do this in caves a lot, but I do it with my mining too, is you put your torches on the right side. And that way, you'll know when you're coming back, because you will find a torch on the left side. Have we been here before? I believe we have. There's coal that way, but I don't care about that. So, we're gonna make some more torches quick, and I'm sorry about how dark this is, guys. So... Guys, can you go up this? Oh, yeah, you go. So, guys, we are just going to go back into our mine and start mining the other way. 
So guys, what you do here is you do not um, mine. All the pit. Oh, I see you here. Come to me. Wait, Come to me. Oh. In my mind. Um, so, you when you are coming back, you do not mine out these two right here, guys. You mine out one next to it. Oh, and you mine what? You mine out right me. here. Great. Mine out this block. And diamonds. Oh my gosh, guys. Wait, let me see. Here, you take a look. <gasps> see? No, do not mine them. Your pick will not mine them. So, guys, as you can see, that's efficiency right there. More diamonds. Yeah, it's good that we found iron right here. I know. We just, the bad thing is that when we run out there, we find more diamonds. So, as you can see, this method actually works very well. So let's go ahead and take these. We got one, two, three diamonds. That's not bad, guys. But whenever you find something like this, it's not easy to find. You want to mine around. Because there can be more diamonds. Uh, like I was saying, there can be more diamonds just lingering around. Hidden behind one piece of stone that you decide not to mine because you can't see them. Owen, oh, can you... Here, I'll just go this way. So guys, that is how to mine diamonds. And then on this side, you want to stagger them again, so you skip two here, and you'd mine right here. And my pickaxe broke. But that is how you mine for diamonds, guys. So then when this mine, when you feel content with this mine and you feel you've gotten everything you want to, all the diamonds you want to out of this mine, you go back up and you just go and pick another spot and mine down to layer 13 and then you can mine down even farther and you can go like from here down to layer 10 and then mine there because if you go like that guys, if you mine right here, then this is the floor on layer 13. So when you mine right here, you'll be on layer 10, and you won't run into your or your um, branches. Sorry guys, I was kind of having a brain fart. So that is how you guys mine for diamonds. And as you can see, we were successful. We found seven diamonds in that short amount of time. That is a good haul. We did not find very much coal, however, we did have a shortage of coal. I, I have 16 coal. No, we did not have a shortage of coal. But guys, I think I may have to end the video soon. So, let me know what you think in the comments. And like this video, comment on this video, and subscribe. So, thank you guys for watching. It really does mean a lot to me. So, I will see... Oh my gosh, more diamonds. How is this even possible, guys? I, I can't believe this. Should we still end the video? You know what, I'll get these diamonds first, and then we can end the video. Oh, I do not have a diamond pickaxe. But we can at least see how many diamonds there are. But as you can see, guys, this level is obviously the best level for mining diamonds. And this way of mining does work. So, guys, I will see you in the next video. It looks like we have a stack of four diamonds here. So even though we cannot mine these, you know what, I want to mine these, but we don't even have a crafting table, so I'm going to make a crafting table quick, and then I'm going to place this down. I, I, I have 11 iron if you need it, just return it. I have 5 iron, so I'm set. Oh. But guys, we are going to take our iron, and we are going to smelt this like a man. Well, he's not a man. Hey! But. You just punched me.
I'm sorry. You have a sword, so I'm sorry. Don't use the sword. You use the sword when I get mad. No, I'm kidding, guys. But, we want this diamond. Because everybody wants diamonds. I mean, on honestly, doesn't pretty much everybody in Minecraft want diamonds? You can't get too many diamonds. Unless you get too many diamonds, which is very hard to do. Why did I do that? I should just make a diamond pickaxe. Oh, yeah. Oh, give me one. Give me one. I'll get you one in a second. Just kidding. What? Just kidding again. What? That means you've got one. Oh. Yes? <laughs> so, guys. Oh, a lot more diamonds than I thought. Maybe five diamonds? Five diamonds? Another thing to remember, guys. Hold shift when you're around lava. I mean, honestly. If you hold shift. You cannot walk off of a block. See, like right now, I'm holding shit. See, he can walk straight at the lava, but he will not walk off of this block. Ah! But when he lets go of shift, he loses all of his stuff and dies. So I think that's a good way to end the video. I get all of his stuff that he dropped. And... I will see you guys in the next episode. If you take all that stuff, up, you're dead. Uh, I already took all the stuff. So guys, I will see you later. Thank you for watching. And we got 12 diamonds out of this. So, obviously, we were successful. And I'll see you guys later. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye now.